We're here this afternoon to discuss proper operation of the ABC 4100 anesthesia syringe pump. Of course, as you can see, it's a tabletop model or it can be mounted to an IV pole. Your choice. Very simple to operate. The durable casing is going to last you for many years to come. To start the proper operation, we simply press the power on switch. It goes through a self-test of the internal circuitry. Everything's correct. It now comes up to the drug library. As you can see, propofol is the most popularly used drug with this device, but you have other choices like alfentanil, etc. You can also use it as a microgram per kilogram per minute pump or ml per hour pump. Lots of options, lots of programming options here because it's a programmable syringe pump. Let's say we're looking for propofol. So we just simply press the uh, propofol button or the enter button rather for, to select propofol. Okay, it's now going to walk you through step by step. It's asking us to confirm the manufacturer of the syringe, which is a BD syringe. So now, anytime the value is correct, we simply press the enter button. We now come over here for the patient weight. Let's say, for example, we have a 100 kilogram patient, just for our demonstration. We now press the enter button. It's now saying load syringe, then press enter. Very simply, we take the flange of the syringe and align it right here, bring it down, we have to push a block and engage the syringe plunger. Very simple to load the syringe. If that's correct, it tells us what to do. We simply press the enter button. 60 ml is flashed up. It detected it's a 60 ml BD syringe, so we're good. We continue the process. It's now saying 100 mics per kilogram is the bol program bolus. You can change that bolus value, but many clinicians use that for their bolus rate or their bolus volume rather. We press the enter button if that's correct. 40 micrograms per kilogram is what many physicians start their propofol infusion. However, if you want to change that, you can. To change the rate, we simply press the rate button, 50, and enter. Now it's saying start by pressing the deliver button. Here we go. It's pumping away. Now what if you get going with a patient you want to increase that rate? Anytime you want to change the rate, simply press the rate button, input the new rate, and press the enter button. It's now pumping at 70 micrograms per kilogram per minute. Let's say you want to decrease it. Again, rate 50, for example, and enter. It's decreased that rate. Let's say you want to put the pump on hold for just a moment. What do we do? We can just press the stop button. It's going to alarm. We can turn the alarm off for two minutes. Anytime you want to start back again, you simply press the deliver button. When your, the infusion is complete, you simply press the off button and you're finished with that patient. You can go to the next patient. We're confident that you'll be pleased with for many years to come with the ABC 4100 device. Please contact us at 1877-WILBURN, 1877-945-2876 to arrange for a no-charge evaluation. Thank you for your time.